Today is October the 17th. It's Tuesday, right? Yay! We're, we kind of record a day early sometimes, and so Dylan with me has a special hat on. What is it, Dylan? So, I have an eclipse hat. I yes. got to see the solar eclipse. Yay! Ring of Fire eclipse, angular eclipse. We talked about it every day last week. My Monday students didn't get to hear it, but we've been talking about it for a few weeks in the lab, the computer lab. So I was really impressed with Dylan's hat because it was a cool event. So you got to see it, and you got to, have, and you looked at it with special viewing glasses, right? Yes. Yeah, we were at the state fair, and we got to see some, see them through the viewing glasses. And then if you look through the trees, when the sun was shining through the trees, it showed the, the shapes of the sun. And we also talked about in class using a colander, a strainer. Yeah. And if you look through it and cast a shadow, you can see the eclipse that way. So there's ways to view it that won't damage your eyes because you never look in the sun, it could damage your eyes, right? Yeah. Yeah, awesome. Oh, uh, and while I was on Google searching up um, all things about a solar eclipse, because I'm really interested about being an astronomer, studying stars, and, and that's how come to the future. That'll be awesome. So yeah, the um, uh, April the 8th is the full eclipse that we'll have, and it's going to come right in our path, because this one was not on our path. So Monday, April the 8th, 2024, is the full eclipse that we'll have in Texas, and everybody's really excited about it. Okay, so let's get to business. Our vision, you ready? Our vision is to be a campus where innovation thrives and growth is limitless. And birthdays today, we have one or two birthdays. AR, it is, my whole list went away. Uh, we have Emma in Miss Matthew's class. So for birthday, Emma in 3D. And we have Dylan. What? It's your birthday. I, you were telling me that, and I was thinking it was the next day, but you know, you said tomorrow. So, happy birthday, Dylan. <laughs> All right, come to my class. I'll get you a Jolly Rancher, okay? Yay. Awesome. Okay, now, what is, what's next? Oh, joke. No, lunch. Go, lunch. Um, today, we are having chili cheese nachos, refried beans with cheese, salsa cup, salsa cup, mm -hmm. pineapple tidbits, and a choice of milk. Awesome. Our joke is, why didn't the skeleton go to the dance? Uh, why don't you read it? You got it? Because he had no body to dance with. <laughs> That's a good one. Was that submitted, Miss Mosley, or you brought it up? And she brought it. She's got some good jokes. She's got a good line on the jokes right now, so I'm, I'm digging that. All right? <laughs> All right. Now, we also have the fifth grade program this Thursday, 8.30 a.m. in the cafeteria for all who would like to come down. So it's an option for teachers that can. Uh, make sure you're thinking and working on your storybook pumpkins because they are due Friday. 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 All right. And the answer to last week's Hispanic Heritage Trivia question was, who was the first brigadier, and, brigadier general and four-star general? In the army, that's the army branch when they talk about brigadiers. There's brigadiers in other places, but that's a rank in the army. So our answer is, what's his name? His name is, it's a guy. His name is Richard Cavazos. Dun, 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 dun. He was the first um, brigadier and he was served in the army and four-star general. That's a big deal when you're... When you get a star, that's like a big deal, okay? And then you get to stay in. All right, and also, um, Miss uh, Miss Garza had another question, so we're just going to put it out there. Which which holiday in, in Hispanic families remember and honor their loved ones with altars, costumes, and making food for the visiting spirits to eat? It's celebrated on November the 1st and 2nd. We're throwing one more out there in case we got confused with her, you know, she wants the right answers. And she said our other winners for Hispanic Heritage Month month are Jerome in 4A, Mila in 4A, Jalen in 5C, Jaden in 5C, Jaden G in 5C, Aiden M in 5D, Amelia W in 5B, and Gabe E in 5B. <laughs> Go to the library and get your prize. All right, now it's time for our pledges and moment of silence. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Amen.
Okay, launch. Our launch is normal is a setting on a washing machine by unknown. That's cool. Normal. Just try to be normal. I don't know. Maybe it's those glasses. It's throwing me off. Okay, ready for the tribe chant? Yeah. And who are we at Clift? We are trustworthy, respectful, inclusive, responsible, and we encourage others. We are a tribe. Bye, y'all. Have a great day.